Hi there! Today I'm going to show you all the features in the Read and Write Chrome extension. I'll start with the ones that are best for test taking, but you can watch the full video to learn about all the features Read and Write has to offer. To start, we're going to go to the top here and we're going to use the play, pause, and stop features. This is great if you're doing a test where you need text read aloud. I'm showing you this feature on a Google Doc, but you could use this on a variety of other types of websites too. To start, I'm going to highlight the paragraph that I want read aloud. Next, I'll press the play button. When you visit a park, you can often find a variety of animals, plants, and trees. Some animals, like birds and squirrels, are easy to spot because they move up. I can choose pause if I want to temporarily stop the read aloud and I can choose stop if I'm done completely. Next, we're going to go over the screenshot reader. To use this feature, you need to first have the screenshot reader extension installed. Let's start by clicking the icon right here. You'll see that there's this button that says add to Chrome. We're going to click on that and install the extension. Once that's done, you can refresh the page. And now we'll try it again. When you click the icon, we can select the part that we want, and now the feature will work. Thought question, what inspires you to step in and help others when they're in trouble? Next up, let's do screen masking. This is like those traditional paper reading windows where part of it is see-through and you can keep track of the line that you're reading. So we're gonna go up here to screen masking and now you'll see that this shadow appeared and this will help us keep our spot. If this is a little too big for you or you would prefer to change the colors, you can click the gear and here you can pick a different color or you can make the light a little bit smaller or larger, whatever works best for you. Then we can close out of this window. When we're all done, we just click the feature again to stop it. Next up, we're gonna use talk and type. You're going to click here and you can just start talking. Technology is important for education. Once you're done, you'll click here and it'll turn off. Now let's look at translate. Choose your language in the settings here. You can first highlight a word, then click the translate button. You can see that this word is now translated into a different language. Now we're gonna look at highlights. So I can start by highlighting something I want with my cursor here, and then choosing the color up in the toolbar. This could be especially useful if you were doing a multiple choice test, for example. You could highlight the answers that you think are correct, or you could even highlight the wrong answers in a certain color, so that way you know, and you can use process of elimination to determine which one is the correct answer. Those were some tools that are especially useful for test taking. And now we'll see the other features that Read and Write has to offer. This tool is called Check It. It allows you to correct spelling and grammar in your writing. This is prediction. It guesses the word you're trying to type to help with spelling. The dictionary icon here allows you to highlight a word and get a definition. The picture dictionary allows you to highlight a word and get a picture to represent the word. Here's a tip. You can use the regular dictionary and the picture dictionary at the same time. Use this icon to collect highlights from a page. Simply highlight the words with one or several colored highlighters. Use this button to clear the highlights if you make a mistake. Then click the button and ta-da! All the words will be copied to a separate Google Doc. Another cool thing you can do with highlights is create a vocab list. Read and Write will take all your highlighted words and create a visual table with definitions and pictures. Audio Maker is right here. 
It will convert text into an audio file so you can listen to everything read aloud, even if you're not on the website. The rapid advancement of technology will reshape nearly every aspect of modern life. Web search is here. It allows you to look up a word to get more information about it from the internet. Simplify page is here. It will take all the words on a page and copy them to a new tab where any menus, ads, or distractions are removed, and the page looks more simplified to help you focus. Rewordify is here. It will take the text you highlighted and change the difficult words so they're more understandable for kids and teens. Practice reading aloud is here. This feature lets you record yourself reading to send to your teacher. The voice notes icon is here. This tool lets you record your voice and insert it into a Google Doc. It's like a comment, but with your voice. This is Hopper Speech. It will start reading the page out loud wherever you put your cursor. Gull is any of a group of long-winged birds that live around the water. Gulls commonly occur. Thanks for watching.